Hello, and thanks for joining me in the second episode of restoring my 1989 Toyota pickup. Um, the main thing on the list of things to work on is figuring out what's wrong with the engine. The gentleman before me said it had low compression, so we need to dive in and figure out what's going on with that. I figured we would just start with taking the heads off and seeing what is going on in there. The first things we're going to have to do is take off the intake manifold, the intake runners, and the fuel system. And once I'm done with that, I'll give you an update of where we are and where we need to go from there. I think that's it for tonight. We got the manifold out. There's a lot more to go before we get down to those head gaskets, but I'm gonna call it tonight and I'll see you in the morning. Same shirt, different day. We're gonna get back into this. I think the next step is to take off the timing belt cover. That'll allow me to get to the uh, valve covers, the fuel rails, a bunch of accessories, and the exhaust manifold. Um, so we're just gonna...
much. It's been forever since I've given you an update. We've made a lot of progress. It looks like we got everything on the intake side out of the way. Um, the big test is going to be what this manifold has behind it um, and how easy these uh, fasteners come out. I'm going to end it there for tonight. We're going to take a break for the rest of the night, come back when I'm refreshed, and then continue on um, and finish this episode up with the cylinder heads completely off. I'll be back in the morning. Okay, it's been about a week since I worked on the truck. I did spend some time off camera taking the exhaust manifolds off and the power steering pump um, primarily because it was a lot of hard to see stuff. I was under the truck a lot um, and in some dark, in the darker areas of the uh, engine bay. So it really wasn't worth uh, recording anything. But now that I have the uh, exhaust manifolds off um, and everything else, the next step is to take the heads off, um, get them on the bench, and then call it quits for this, uh, this episode. Now we know what we're into. Got to look at the cylinders. A couple things that I suspected were true. Other than that, I mean, everything kind of looks the way I expected it to. It didn't go into this thinking that I was gonna have a pristine engine underneath the, uh, the cylinder heads. A lot of it looks in really good condition. There's just a couple things that I need to uh, take care of. Since I'm this far into it, I might be pulling the engine block all the way out. Anyways, um, glad to get the uh, heads off. Um, glad to know what I'm dealing with. Uh, thank you for watching. Um, in the next episode, we'll be moving along with the project. Not sure what exactly I'll be doing. Thanks for watching, um, and I will see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>